This is the ultimate red herring. What we should be talking about is things like people are dying in our city from gun violence. What we should be talking about is the tax burden that is driving middle class and low income families out of the city. The fact that we are the only metropolitan area in the country that's losing population ought to be a sense of urgency and we should be talking about this, those issues, not this crazy red herring distraction that is of no moment or consequence to the rea reality of people's lives and what people care about. But they're challenging your integrity, saying that you stayed on the police board because you had motivations that are political now with your run for mayor. Of course they're challenging my integrity because they are the status quo. They are afraid of the course that we are going to lead this city on. I, in this one week, one week since I announced my candidacy, I've heard from people all over this city applauding what we are talking about and what we are doing because they see that the city is going in the wrong direction. They reject the status quo and they want this city and a leader who will take them on a different course. A leader who will listen, a leader who will pay attention, who will be a presence in the neighborhood and who will not dole out city resources and city services and make policy based on who you are instead of what is actually in the best interest of the city. So of course they're challenging my integrity. That's what they do. But I'm gonna stay focused on the issues that are of most importance to people's lives every day.